All right, welcome back, champions. We're going to be going through QR class number six, fractions, decimals, and ratios. So without further ado, let's get into our skill development here. Okay, now in terms of simplicity, nothing really does beat fractions, decimals, and percentages in terms of just general mathematics. You see, working with fractions and decimals is really painfully simple. Everyone, including you, can do this. But that's not where the gains are made in quantitative reason. Really, the realest gains from being able uh, are coming from being able to mentally convert between these fractions, decimals, and percentages with speed. So if you're already quick at these conversions, I can guarantee you, you can get faster. However, if you're slower at this, that's okay, because now is the time to work on this. So flipping over, we see this table. And I think this is a table that we should really be committing to memory, okay? Looks intimidating, but if you really look at it, it's not that much to remember, seeing as if that, um, seeing as really half, we should all know, is 0 0.5, one third, 0 0.33, one fourth, 0 0.25, one fifth, 0 0.2, one tenth, 0 0.1, okay? There's only really four other ones to try and remember here. One sixth, if you're ever stuck for it, just remember it's half of one third. So 33, divided by two is around about 0.167, all right? Or I should say 0.33. And then one seventh is quite a difficult one to remember, but I always correlated 14 with the number seven, you know, seven times two. And that's how I committed to memory. One eighth, how I committed that was um, half of one quarter, which gave us one eighth, which means 0.5 times 0.25, giving us 0.125. Or simply, if you just want to get half of 25, that gives you 12.5. Bam, there you go. And I might actually add one more over here. 1 over 11, which equals 0.09. And how I remembered 1 over 9 and 1 over 11 was that basically the two numbers flip in each case. 9, 11 here and 11, nine here, okay? And th the benefit I really get from having this table in front of me or actually committing it to memory rather is that as soon as I see the fraction say one sixth, I don't need to waste time putting this into the calculator and figuring out what it is, okay? I know that it's this number pretty much, okay? And you get some really good uh, speed gains from that. Now, moving on to ratios. What are they? Essentially, they are simplest fractions flipped on their side. So if we have, say, four to six, the simplest version of this is two to three. And you would see a ratio like this. So think of it like this happening. And then, <laughs> I don't know. Essentially, they're really similar, similar to fractions, okay? So that being said, if you are competent with fractions, you will 100% be competent with ratios. There's almost nothing different about them, okay? But the one trick that they can play on you is with wording, okay? This is the most important catch when it comes to ratios. It can be the difference between getting a question right and wrong, okay? And that is that the ratio of, say, lemons to oranges does not equal the ratio of oranges to lemons. Let's just say, for example, we had three lemons and five oranges. Okay, Are we to say that three to five is the same ratio as five to three? No, this just doesn't make sense. It'd be saying that three to five is equal to five over three. Okay, And that's simply not the case. So with wording, we need to be extremely careful because that is where they end up playing those tricks. Moving on to the action items. First of all, commit that conversion table to memory, okay? Because it can be really, really helpful for really just saving time wherever possible. And use these conversions anywhere you can to save yourself that time. Even if it feels a bit slower at first, I guarantee it will make you a lot faster in the long run. And that's what we're looking for long-term progress at the end of the day, okay? So that has been fractions, decimals, ratios, and percentages. Well done, 
and I will see you next time.